Welcome back. You're still tuned into Midcap Radar on CNBC TV 18. This is our special segment, Midcap Spotlight, where I'm actually focusing on KC International. The stock is buzzing in trade. There have been a lot of uh, new order updates that have come by as well. Where actually tell us more. Well, absolutely. A slew of order wins uh, for KEC. Very recently, in fact, just yesterday, the company announced that they've secured orders worth 1,017 crores and they've received these orders for EPC projects and supply of towers in the Middle East. And additionally, they've also secured the largest solar order in India. In fact, just a couple of days ago, on June 26, they also announced winning orders worth 1,025 crores in TND and the cables business. So with these orders now coming in, the year-to-date order inflow for the company now stands at over over 5,000 crores. Keep in mind that the company had guided uh, for an order inflow of almost 25,000 crores in FY25 and so far the company has managed to achieve nearly 20% of its guidance. In fact, the management also joined us recently and indicated that currently the order book stands a little over 30,000 crores. They've got an L1 position of almost 8,000 crores and nearly 90% of this L1 book is in the TND space. They also highlighted that government bodies are going back to their board for a awarding projects with the elections now behind so they're expecting L1 conversions uh, to order soon and in fact they're expecting a lot more ordering activity in the second quarter as compared to the first quarter. They also additionally said that they've bid for large solar projects and they're expecting to bid for some more of these solar projects. So overall uh, they're winning uh, quite a few orders and as a result the stock is abuzz in the trading session today. Well, actually, thanks a lot for that update. A new record high in today's session for KC International around 968 is the intraday high. The stock significantly off the highs of the day, but still managing to hold on to gains of around 2.5%. But on to some primary market 